kid, you look at them. What are they begging for? This is torture. Put them out of here. No, what about us? You know, I, I really feel crummy about this guy. Then we back for himself. And what about all the women? And the children? And the cute little wooden puppets? And some cute piggies? Yeah. Oh, there's three of them. Okay. My slumber. Oh, it's me, Pinocchio. <laughs> hey. Listen, we must help these people. Oh, we have guests. Hi there, folks. Welcome to Lord Farquaad's castle. Run for your lives! Oh, rather lackluster bunch. Yeah. Well, they don't understand what's happened. You need to tell them the story. Sure. <clears throat> a long time ago, in a galaxy far, far away. Our story! Oh, so, so sorry, I've been feeling really spaced out lately. Oh. You know, once upon a time! <clears throat> once upon a time, there lived a frightful ogre named Shrek. He lived alone in his swamp, far from those who would judge him by appearance, rather than what lay within. Oh, I miss that smelly yeah, ogre. Me too. Yeah, one to me, three. Shh. One night, after saving a talking donkey, in the morning, and the lights, Shrek's home was overrun by a horde of fairy tale creatures, banished from the kingdom of Duloc. Check out the handsome pig on the left. <clears throat> banished from the kingdom of Duloc by the evil Lord Farquaad. Oh, As everyone found his, his little twerk. Oh, I'm... where was I? Through a couple of plot twists. And wrestling moves. Farquaad agreed to return Shrek Swamp to him if he would rescue the fair Princess Fiona. Ah, from a fearsome, fire-breathing dragon, Shrek and Donkey set off on their quest. There was lots of amazing action, pyrotechnics, and heroics. Shrek saved the princess and his ass. And then, excuse me, something miraculous happened. Shrek fell in love. And to her astonishment, the princess fell right back in love with him. Oh, that's lovely. I love so cute. But she was to marry Farquaad. And Shrek's heart was broken. Donkey talked some sense into the stubborn ogre, who set out to rescue the princess again, but this time from Farquaad. Fiona revealed her big secret. She was actually an ogress, and Donkey got it on with the dragon. Wait, Farquaad! Whose death freed all the fairy tale creatures and allowed Shrek to find true love. And everyone lived happily ever after. What's going on in here? No. Lord Farquaad, my, you're, you're looking rather pale. Of course I am. I'm a ghost, you fool. Now for the last time, tell me where she is. My batteries are low, my lord. I, I can't see further than the past at the present. Well, what about your little wooden friend? Is he ready to talk? Yeah. Where that repulsive green monstrosity has taken my Fiona. Where are they? I, I don't know. Oh, is it His mood, the puppet's fire. No! Leave him alone! Leave him alone! Oh, my little porkers. Are you going to spill the beans? Or is it the out time? We, we, we don't know anything. Yeah. We know nothing. Yeah! yeah. Dig a pit like fire and wrap them in 
banana leaves. Lulu? What are you people looking at? Have any of you seen Shrek the Have you? I have. No, I have. No, where they are. Anyone? Fine. A major talk. Polonius, prepare the auditorium. Who's who? Mirror, mirror, on the wall, tell them what will happen to the wall. I must go prepare. I'll be in to torture you later. All of you! <laughs> well, let that's over, Papa. It's just beginning. Yeah. This is the beginning of the end. Yeah. As the auditorium opens, please enter in an orderly fashion and take a seat as far over as possible. Do not wear your glasses until you are seated, unless you like falling over. Please do not eat, drink, smoke, or puke. All cell phone users will be flogged. Flash photographers will be burned at the stake. You have been warned. Enjoy the show. Then you're all doomed. Quickly, prisoners, into the main torturing chamber. Once inside, find a row. Move all the way down to your left. Do not stop in the middle. Do not force others to cross over you. Quickly, prisoners, again, find a row inside. Move all the way down to your left. 